is Susan Riley from EducationCloset.com, and today I just want to take a brief minute to talk to all of you out there who are on the fence about whether or not to attend our summer online STEAM conference opportunity. If you've already decided that this event is not for you, go ahead and ignore this video. Um, but if you're on the fence, if you're thinking about it, if you're considering the opportunity, but you're not sure if it's the right um, professional development opportunity for you, this message is for you. Um, you know, we've been spending the last several months really working uh, to pull this conference together to make it something that's going to be valuable and relevant to all educators out there. Uh, we are all inundated with the overwhelming changes that have been going on, especially this year. We understand how frustrated you are between having to implement Common Core, looking at teacher evaluations through SLOs or SGOs, and then feeling like the arts are kind of falling behind. And how do we make teaching creative again for our kids? All of this is coming at us at once, and it feels really overwhelming. We get it. This conference is going to show you how all the pieces fit together. That's why I'm so excited that um, this is happening this July. Because in this conference, we have pulled together uh, presenters and exhibitors that are going to show you practical, time-tested techniques for how to pull in the arts and integrate it effectively through Common Core, through your teacher evaluations, and through STEM. So it's not one more thing, but instead it really makes all of the puzzle pieces pull together into this beautiful kind of tapestry that um, you can see how we can ignite student learning again. You will walk away refreshed and excited with practical techniques and tips that you can take away and implement into your classrooms right away in the fall. So you can walk into your school in the end of August, the beginning of September, energized and ready to go. Um, in addition to all of that, we have this great STEAM pack that is coming to the first 500 registrants of the conference this year. And it's loaded with free product samples and coupons and demos and information and magazines that you can use beyond this conference um, with, with your students and for your own professional learning. So it's a really great opportunity to refresh and reboot. And I don't want you to miss it. Registration is going on from now until July 20th, but if you want to get your STEAM pack, you need to register as soon as possible because those things are flying off <laughs> the shelf, so to speak. Those packs will go out one week prior to the conference, but right now we've already had a great burst of registrations because people don't want to miss out on that STEAM pack, and you shouldn't either. Our early bird registration closes on April 1st. And so I really want you to take this opportunity to think about if this is right for you. Because if it is, if you really want to re-energize yourself and take time for yourself this summer um, to learn and grow in a format that is so easy to attend, all you have to do is have an internet browser open. You can do it from your phone, from home, from school, wherever it's convenient for you. Um, if this is an opportunity that excites you, I encourage you to register as soon as you can because I want you to get all of this, all of this great conference experience with the discounts that we're currently offering. So early bird registration closes on April 1st. Don't miss that. Um, it saves you $15 on registration right at the bat. And the earlier you register, the more likely it is that you're going to receive that Steam Pack with a value of over $500 sent to you for free as part of the registration for this conference. So don't miss it. I really hope that, you, that you'll attend and um, participate with us because we are better when we work together. So I look forward to seeing you at the Steam Conference, and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful spring. Thanks.